Walking Hong Kong streets Dear Lord, show me a sign Give me a map, show me the way Let's just look up, capture all these cool looking buildings all the way around Imagine living in, in that right over there and, that skinny little bit. and then when you come back over here we have the orange house and the greenhouse and then there's the blue house we can only see it's blue from the one side yep so we have the and i think house. coming up we're gonna see um pak thai temple which should be right here i believe oh. or here sorry we're on stone mala lane we have the blue house, the yellow house, and it says typical pre-war buildings with a history over 80 years. And, um, and I think there's a lot of history right in here. So we're going to try to capture that and I'm with my daughter. Dun, dun, dun. <laughs> and we'll give you some context and um, kind of tell you what we can see in this area. So it's uh, 2024 and we're going to check out Stonella Lane. Okay, 2024, we're in Hong Kong. Come on this way. Walking Hong Kong streets, double deck trams going by, crowded streets of people. I love this town. Okay, so Stone Little Lane, the first thing we're gonna do is just look up, capture all these cool looking buildings all the way around. Imagine living in, in that right over there like that skinny little building and you got kind of all these amazing views everywhere so you want to hold the camera so i got my daughter we're going to check out stone on the lane Let's see what all we can see Actually, I saw these. These are like, I guess these have cart noodles everywhere in Hong Kong, historically. And then they kind of, um, they, they moved them out of the street. So then people end up moving them into establishments. But I guess they were cart noodles because they were like basically uh, street food. So that looks like a little remnant of the cart noodles. And actually, I don't know if you remember, but when we were in Macau, yeah. actually there's some kind of cool stuff in the walls in here. But when we were in Macau, there was also some cart noodles in one of the um, casinos. And then that one was, um, uh, I think, kind of captured the style of uh, Hong Kong cart noodles. I think it was the, um, one of those restaurants had that focus to it. Now we're going to New Street. King New Street. I like that building right there. The blue building. Can you read those Chinese characters right there? No. Nope. Okay, this one. Hong Kong House of Stories. So I think they um they have a Kind of all kinds of cool stuff. Okay. No, we're now at another new street. One street. And then now we have the we have the yellow house right there. Yep. And then um, let's just kind of take a, take a quick glance where we're at. And then when you come back over here, we have the orange house and the greenhouse. And then there's the blue house. We can only see it's blue from the one side. Yep. So we have the green, orange, blue, and the yellow. So I think yeah. Stone Mola Lane is known for those four houses like that. Mm. And I think I was reading something about them and the way that they were, um, I think they were set up in a time period when it was like kind of more for the middle classes to 
move into a certain area, I think. Have to review that a little bit. Actually, I have. I have a book. There's a book. <laughs> a lot of books. We got this one right here. So actually it's still another lane is um is right in here. So in the future I'm gonna narrate more but one of the, a few things it says is that uh, this one came down the hillside from Kennedy Road. So Kennedy Road is straight ahead. And there's also a temple straight ahead too. And this flowed all the way down to the harbor. And I think coming up we're going to see um, Pak Tai Temple, which should be right here, I believe. Or here, sorry. So we're going to see some temples. And that's at the top. Stone Nulla. It's about a. Um, it's like um, I have to read a little bit more about the history, but you can see some beautiful pictures of of it historically. So in the future, I'm definitely going to. Um, oh, look at this! You see that green dragon? Yeah. So this is 2024, Year of the Dragon, but it's specifically the Year of the Green Dragon. So I don't know if they brought that out specifically for that or not. Hmm. But that's pretty cool. Actually, the flowers smell really nice too, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, you can smell them. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> nice. I don't know if I can bring a camera in here, but I really want to capture that lantern right there. Okay. I think we're not supposed to film Buddha, I think, in particular. <laughs> but um, I, might, I might capture that lantern though, real quick. Yeah, this is really nice out here. And actually, like, it's got a beautiful um, banyan tree right here, too. This is amazing. Some of the things I love is these, the trees in Hong Kong are amazing. So anyways, I'm kind of getting a nice touch of, uh, how's that feel? Is it like, Wormy? Yep. <laughs> that's, that's, I like that description. So they got some Chinese New Year stuff set up as well. They have um, the tangerines. Looks like they got some things set up for for something. And um, so that's actually Stone Mullah Lane. And um, and that's actually a temple right there. I'll have to read about it more and, and synthesize it more. So I think what we'll do is we'll just come up to the to the hilltop part and then we'll get some kind of conclusion for our hill. And that goes up to Kennedy. But I think we're going to just come up right here. And that's kind of the bulk of the street right there. Walking Hong Kong streets, double deck trams going by. 
Crowded streets of people I love this town 